<laughs> oh shit. Yeah, it's an adventure. I was d not expecting to hear, like, Final Fantasy VII, <laughs> like, just outside the realms of copyright infringement music I was music also not expecting this. to see Africa and, like, Saudi Arabia in the, the Indian Peninsula there. This is as big of an adventure as you could possibly get. When I heard of the Adventures of Chris, I thought it would be like a fictional world. It's like, that's the planet Earth. So you're telling me, though, that Saudi Arabia is in a cold war with Iran in the in the world of the Adventures of Chris, because those continents still exist in this world. Yeah. Oh yeah, all those little yellow dots symbolize war events happening that's right nu now. That's nuclear bombs go being detonated all over the planet. <laughs> that kind of looks like Chris. <laughs> No, it doesn't. Don't say that about my friend Chris. I'm just saying, if you put that guy and Chris next to each other and put swap them around ten times, I wouldn't know who's who. Welp, time to start heading home. No homework tonight, so time for some 16-bit video game <laughs> awesomeness. I kind of like this guy. That's like a good- That's I can relate to that sentiment. I'm not scared, I'm not scared, I'm not scared. He says it three times, that's how that's scary That's the thing is. we always say. Yeah, I'm, not I'm, scared, not a, I'm not scared, I'm not scared, I'm not scared! <laughs> I'm not scared in here in Alabama. Look, <laughs> gold. <laughs> no. Floating cookies. Floating cookies. <laughs> what the deuce? This is so random. That's more than a little weird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too fat to get the cookies. Sorry. Sorry. I wish I could jump higher. Uh, I guess I'll never get those floating cookies. <laughs> These little punches are quite extreme. I'd describe them as extreme. If somebody Can punched you, you like that in real life, yeah, you, 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 I think it caved your head in about 15 places. <laughs> I thought those were tits for a second there. Wee, wee. He laughs like loud junk. Wee, wee. He laughs like the loud junk coach in a new coach. This is definitely some like horrid deviant art person <laughs> made. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's got like a little balloon world now. Welcome to Balloon World. We are the balloon lights. <laughs> We are the Balloonians, I'm and we- I'm one of you, look! <laughs> Guys, please don't capture me! <laughs> look, he's stealing me! Come with us to Balloontopia! <laughs> There's a dog! It's literally his fucking Balloontopia! <laughs> oh, I'm just a kid who got transformed! I want to go home to Alabama! <laughs> As a balloon, I understand your plight! At the end of this f fucking adventure, is he gonna get, like, an M4 and then go into school and show all the bullies what he learned. He's gonna inflate he huge and just kill everybody by yeah. smothering them. He's gonna walk in with a trench coat and he's gonna inflate himself <laughs> and the trench coat flies off. <laughs> Impaling everybody. Mario inflates. Mario inflates. Oh, I'm getting my stomach is oh, getting big. Fuck. Oh, Luigi, whatever you do, don't look at my stomach. It's getting so much bigger this time. I cannot help but duck, brother. I love to watch. We're going to Mexico to fight the, c the cartels. <laughs> I'm going to float above the cartel. Get him, get down! I can't catch him, get him down! I want to catch you so badly, but you're floating above me! Uh, hi, I'm Chris, and I was told you could make me an awesome magic suit. Perhaps. That's not going to be the last time in your life that you say that <laughs> sentence, you know that, right? Nice Those choice. might even be the last words the real Chris ever says. <laughs> Let's gain the fire powers of Mexico. Ew, this is scary. Can, can people from Mexico tell us if this really- if you walk out inside your house, if, do you really see that? <laughs> <laughs> can you go up there? Is there a secret up there? <gasps> SECRET COOKIES! Yeah, I knew it, I knew it! <laughs> oh, way out. Okay, so I got a checkpoint now. So in other words, you could like leave and come back to this level at that checkpoint? Mm-hmm. Mmm. Not bad, huh? <laughs> Th like, this is weirdly like intuitive, like that's a nice touch. <laughs> yeah, that's- that's good, that's just good. That's just a good idea. Would you fund a game called The Adventures of Lyle? No, not not in a million years. Why not? Cause what if you could see? Ever always wanted to see what it'd be like if you went around the world. And, We're in the and video battled, game realm. Yeah, vi in the video game. I guess you're kind of selling me on it. Depends on what the Kickstarter looked like. This almost sounds like the Family Guy chicken fight music. Whoa! It does kind of the the. I know which part you mean. <laughs> he owns this town. He's the smog monster. He owns LA. Every puff of smog in LA answers to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what rocks. fucking backwater cunt made this game? <laughs> Look, can I try it after you? Or can I try it? Yeah, sure. I want to play the Adventures of Chris. Okay. And you can't you can't use your balloon powers here. I think this is the first time Zach has actually asked to play a video game. <laughs> yeah. he, he loved what the about adventures. this one? Is enthralled you? <laughs> Look at it! <laughs> it's awesome. Okay, good point. What's, what's not compelling about this situation? You know the bridge where we saw Rebecca Sugar walking that one time? We saw Rebecca Sugar walking? Yeah, we called it the Rebecca Sugar Bridge. Uh, was I there for that? 
Oh no, that was me and Veronica. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Do you know what I saw in downtown LA recently? What? A woman, like, facing outward onto the street, blasting shit, like, diarrhea onto the sidewalk, <laughs> and then she picked up a rag, wiped her pussy and ass with it, and threw it into the center of the road. <laughs> you have to admit, that person's probably happier than all of us combined, though. If I, could, if I could shit- if I could shit diarrhea out of my pussy and my ass and then wipe a rag, and just keep on my way, I think I'd be happy. Remember, inflation is the key. I- I forgot to hold it, too. You can quote okay, me on okay. that. This is such an amazing oh, adventure. Oh, this is intense, man. You're doing it, though. You're kicking ass. Oh, fuck. You're re- Look, Damn it! <laughs> God damn it. Is this the new Dark Souls? Well, if Harvey Weinstein walked in and he was like, I'm gonna put you in the new, uh, right, uh fuck this the game. new, uh, big yeah. movie. But you have to play with my weenus. Would I do it? Mm-hmm. Why well, I'm gonna put you in Goodwill Hunting number two. <laughs> He's gonna put you in the next Tarantino movie. I'm gonna movie. call it- I'm making a new movie, Lyle. It's called Lyle Will Hunting. <laughs> <laughs> cool Lyle Hunting. Are you in Lapland? Where are you? Lapland? Are you in Lapland? What is Lapland? Uh, that's where Santa lives. Lapland? Yeah. In what? What? You've never heard of Lapland? Never in my whole life. What? Like, you, like you sit on his lap? No! <laughs> this is where Sand- that's where he's- Where? Live. From, he lives in the North was, Pole! Yeah, yes! Lapland. Lapland! Lapland! Okay, are you fucking with me? No! In Ireland, do what they is... actually call the North Pole Lapland? Yes! Really? What? As in what? From what? Derived from I what? I don't know, look it up! Zach, do you have your phone on you? <laughs> Lapland? Look yeah. up Lapland and see where it derives from. L Lapland is an area in Finland. Yeah, that's where Santa lives. <laughs> Santa lives in the North Pole. Uh, <laughs> Wait, Lapland Santa? Oh, maybe look at Look at Lapland Santa. This isn't real. It the is. Fuck. Oh my god, I gotta do that Ro whole fucking thing Ro again. Robot Amy is the official hometown of Santa Claus in Lapland. Uh huh. You what? can find many program service companies, souvenir shops. Wait, what? What is this? Wait, what? So, wait. Santa's like Scandinavian. Oh, oh, oh no! I, in I, I, I see what this is. What is it? This is literally a real place in in Finland or whatever, uh -huh. where they say it's it's like it looks like the North Pole. Oh, really? I think. <laughs> no, -uh. no way. It's real. Santa Claus Village. Yeah, it's like a village in Lapland. Mm. But I don't think he lived. <laughs> <laughs> is that my whole childhood ruined? Do they say that he's from Finland in Ireland? No, they say he's from Lapland. I always thought Lapland was a place in the North Pole. <laughs> it's a, it's, that's like saying Santa Claus lives in Missouri or something. <laughs> <laughs> I truly believe that my whole life. I am from Kansas City, Missouri. I know Santa's dead and all. I know he's not real. And he he's died dead. in 1982. I know he's mummified and has no eyes and his skin's black and he's backwards. And he's in a huge sarcophagus with uh, steam coming out of it. <laughs> <laughs> and it says, do that open in, in an ancient like, an ancient text, unreadable text. But I still thought he was from Lapland, regardless all of all that. All that considered. <laughs> so, according to my calculations, you have two more abilities. I can't believe canonically Chris has a fly that his dick comes out of. What? Is a fly in his pants. <laughs> There's a fly in his pants in this gun? Yeah. So now we can float fall. You know what I mean, right? The little opening in his pants where his penis oh, comes out. I, did, I'm an I didn't idiot. mean an insect. I literally was- I was like- I was- in my head I was picturing like a fly coming out of his pocket. Oh, you can glide now. Yeah. This is insanity. That's what that balloon guy just gave me. And you're eating cookies up your ass, see that? Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're eating them through your ass. He's not eating them through his ass, you fuckheads. He's storing them in his ass for later. Well, the burden of proof is on you, because that appears very confidently. Uh, but I found the Russian flag, All right, so. I take what I said back, I'm sorry. I don't think you're gonna be able to beat this thing either. That sounds exactly like the first couple of notes in the Family Guy chicken fight song. It does, actually. It's really sad. The, the first time you see the chicken fight, it's like the most magically funny thing in the world. <laughs> it really was. It was like hysterically it funny. Was. And then they just completely ruined it. They did it what, like ten times? They did a bunch, and yeah, they did it a bunch, and it never, they never added anything new to it. Yeah, it's just the same joke. If, if, if anything, I liked the uh, the Peter versus Homer fight because at least <laughs> at least they become irradiated and stuff. It's like it's like really weird and cartoony. I like the Peter versus Homer fight because they literally just like start like killing everyone in Springfield for no reason. And also, doesn't Peter like smash Homer's head into a rock, like trying to kill him too? <laughs> yeah, it's really yeah. fucking violent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, like who is that for? The only people who, who would want to see a Simpsons family crossover are little kids, and then they watch that. They see the like Homer's teeth coming out of him groaning, and, <laughs> and his eyeballs all <laughs> veiny and death. 
<laughs> so evil. That's the same character that said, Bert, do you like the milkshake? Mosquitoes? Mosquitoes and more mosquitoes. Yep. And they're green. And they glow. Those are three facts that I hate about these mosquitoes. One, they're green. Two, they glow. <laughs> number one, they're green. Number two, they glow. Number three, well, they're mosquitoes. <laughs> 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 That's so stupid. Here, can I try? I, I think yeah. I got a strategy for this. Okay. Put the Little phrase case. Lyle strategy on Fuck. screen so we know. Lyle strat. Whoa. My oh my god. god. You are actually kind of good. Lyle strategy gets a big green check mark next week because look what happened. Hi there, Buzzkill, right? Oh, I'm Chris. I'm wondering if I could, you know, have that Jack in the Box there you got from Count Junior? Count Junior. I mean, I don't really need it. I'm sure that kid would like to go home, so, uh, I don't what know. What is it? <laughs> Did you say hate? Yeah, hate. 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 Die. <laughs> Die. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck, fuck you. you. I'm you. fucking wish we don't. Fat, fat, fat. I can match this one in power. But can you imagine in wits? This oh, is the wittiest bug I ever saw. Uh, Fuck! <laughs> oh my god, Lyle. Lyle! Oh, god. Oh. oh my god! Lyle, this is insane. Lyle, you, you are the greatest! Oh, Lyle, shit. how are Lyle. you doing this? Lyle! Ah, Lyle! Lyle. Yes. <laughs> oh my god, look at you! Oh, oh my Jesus. god, he was a bug! Oh, bug, you can do yes. it! Yes! You can do two, it! One or two more hits, one or two more hits! Just jump on him! Ah, yes! 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 Oh my god. Oh no! 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 What the fuck? Oh my god. What is this game? <laughs> what the fuck? What? How the fuck? Oh no. Ah! What? He, he got just... it. He sucked blood out of you. And he turned inflatable. What the fuck? He just drank the fucking... <laughs> uh, ew. That's insane. I hope I'm not being too hyperbolic, but this might be the best game ever made. <laughs> I think uh, it's true. I'd say let's go to Chile. Yeah, let's go to Chile. Chile. Don't look at that. What the Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> that is not what happens in Chile. How do you know? Uh, okay, never mind. I've never been there. I think I there. saw this on some news channel. I never thought we'd play a game about sucking gas into a boy. And, and it would be named ass. after you. Yeah, red phosphorus gas in this boy's ass, so we, yet we love this game. Wow. Go, my little blue. Oh. Lolly, you're my little blue. Thanks, man. Oh, fuck <laughs> you. <laughs> what the fuck? This is as hard as the boss fight is. This, this is harder this is than real life. This is harder than hell. <laughs> Oh god, it's going down! <laughs> you can do it, Lyle, you can do it, you're amazing. Oh god! Oh. Yeah, this one I think is the easiest. Yeah! All yeah! Right. Oh! There's so many fucking enemies, dude, look at that, there's like 60 people on screen. 60 people? <laughs> you know what, I'm gonna go back to the L.A. fart and kill him first. Okay. You really have a dead against this character. Oh, it's that fucking asshole. Wee <laughs> wee. His red orb is on the prowl. Good day! My Good day, name is Blue Freddy Jones! <laughs> Don't you mind all my bloody fucking- Oh, but you said it over here, <laughs> crazy dude! I love his obnoxious face. I fucking love the adventures of Chris. I'm enthralled by this. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm enchanted. I've, I've downloaded enchanted. Can we please get everyone in the world to buy this guy's game yes, so he becomes everyone, a millionaire? Everyone, there's, there's, sincerely, there's so much effort put into the images of Chris. There's genuinely never been like a dull moment. Like I've never <laughs> been playing this and thought like, man, I'm I'm very bored of the adventures no, they of Chris. No, change the mechanics up constantly. And it's actually fun to control. The Great Barrier Reef got covered in Coca-Cola and it's gone now. No wonder they fucking destroyed the Great Barrier Reef. Yeah, if this was going on in there, they got rid of all those crabs. I'm happy about that. They Remember destroyed the, the Great Barrier Reef so he could get his milkshake, so no. Chris could get his milkshake on his adventure. Whoa. What the fuck? What the heck is Why, that? Why haven't you ever seen a giant mutated sea cucumber before? <laughs> I usually pick the cucumbers out of my out sides. Of my ass. I miss uh, Amy Schumer. I thought she was pretty cool. Did you see her trash bag special? <laughs> I'm sorry, I mean leather special. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like she's wearing a, a garbage bag in that. I thought she was actually quite beautiful in that. I'm not even commenting on her appearance for Pete's sake. I'm just saying her. I'm not, she, I'm not even trying to degrade her. Or I would just, never, and I would never, but it looks like she's wearing a garbage bag in that. She looks like a, a, a fat trash <laughs> pig in that. <laughs> fat trash pig. <laughs> I would feel bad, but I hate her. Oh no. Susan Wojcicki's gonna fucking censor that because you can't call her. She's a gonna fat blast trash. the snot on my channel. <laughs> I also. Hey, would you ever think of like a word or like a phrase or an idea and you're like, oh, no, no one's thought of that. 
Like I thought of the word spicy toilet water. I didn't want to do anything with it, but I was just like, has anyone, has anyone thought of the phrase spicy toilet water? Yeah, and then you find some guy's Reddit account made eight years ago that's no, just people, called people, spicy I, toilet I, water. No, people, people, I just searched the phrase spicy toilet water on Twitter, people were like, because I was, I drank something that tasted like spicy toilet water. It was, it was really <laughs> the only way I could describe it. And sure enough, that phrase has been said, not even just like once, it's been said like 15 times. Wow. And I was like, how the fuck have 15, even 15 people thought of the phrase spicy toilet water? It's a big fucking world, man. I know, big planet. Four kids left to rescue. I can do this, I think. <laughs> I love that. This game rocks. While saying, uh... <laughs> I forget all the words. We are gonna fight, uh, the semen enemy or something. Stop, you're making me thirsty, dude. <laughs> Chris, if you could do this in real life to get the cookies really on top of your on your refrigerator, would you do that? Would you inflate your belly up like that? Uh, I think inflation's a beautiful thing, honestly. Yeah, it's just the way God intended. I am okay. Like, just <laughs> stick the landing. That's like, so just, what's that from? It's for me right now. I tell you to <laughs> stick the fucking landing. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh shit! You knocked that away. <laughs> Every spicy little morsel. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, who's that? Who is that out there inside the- Oh my god. That can't be. That really can't be. I'm a huge fan. It's Scotty from Austin Powers. <laughs> <laughs> Seth Green. Oh, Seth Green. I know his name. I'm just saying that is Scotty from Austin Powers at the end of Austin Powers 3. Gold number. Oh no. Alright. Oh. Large urchin, right? You said you wanted to see mo- uh Oh. Wee. Wee. <laughs> He says, Way hey, hey, large urchin, you are a fool to have invited me to your quaint little. <laughs> what does he say? Why don't you give him a Mexican Hobble? accent? Hey, what's up? <laughs> that was, yeah, Peter, not Peter Lord. Who am I thinking of? Hello, Igor, Igor plus. <laughs> Igor, kind Mexican of like a fucking Orson Welles Igor. Or Orson Welles Mexican Igor, yeah. You brought it back into like a Mexican accent. I shall now make an example of your man. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Way, hey. Must pop all lost balloons to the pop self. Think of Fettuccine Alfredo. Think of Epcot Center. <laughs> think of Chrono Trigger. Yes! Yeah! I gotta it's, fight this stupid dang old thing. I would call it oh stupid. Oh my god. This is the most powerful entity in the universe. Oh, oh, Chris, you're doing it. Kill this urchin. I hate urchins. You don't mean that. We're, we're doing all right here. It's not yeah. that hard. Yeah, we're actually doing uh, pretty good, actually. We're actually not I, bad. I, no, no, and I was gonna say, we're not even doing that bad. I mean, look at I me. Mean, you're flooding, you're getting the cookies. Look at this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, we should be getting the cookies. I actually forgot about that. Yeah, yeah they upgrade upgrades, your shit. Yeah. It's not just for show, dude. That's really... It's not okay, I know. It's not okay. And, I thought, and I've been sending you death text threats. messages, death threats about that. <laughs> <laughs> I see you have not responded to my prior death threats. <laughs> what was the last time you sent a really good death threat? Uh, last week, actually. What did you say? Well, I don't want to get into it, but basically, somebody defied me, and I really just had to put a stop to it. Does, does that make sense when I say that? I feel like that's the normal, like, like as a man. Yeah, as a man, somebody defies you. As somebody, a human male, you if somebody, need... if somebody insults your lineage... <laughs> <laughs> if, somebody, if, somebody, if somebody insults any ancestor you've had within the last 1,000 years, you're entitled to uh, duel them. Yeah. I do miss dueling people and killing them back in Ireland. Let's talk about Lyle's lineage. Yeah, Lyle. It is a proud one. What's Go your, on. Who's your favorite ancestor? Uh, my fr my favorite ancestor is uh, has got to be old uh, Augustus Lylebert, who came here on the bar. <laughs> and, and, and and what and he's famous Ow. for. I mean, we all know. Well, I mean, we, here we, on know, the we know. For we one. know. We know. We know what what Sir Lylebert was famous for. But can you just explain to the audience what? I mean, just enlighten them, basically. Well, he was a great conqueror. He great discovered man. malaria. He brought it to the Western world. <laughs> yep. Um, discovered AIDS too, by the way. Yeah. I think brought he that it. there too. Yep. Yeah. He's he's. Cre he he's not credited as the father of AIDS, no, which they, is they, a little bit of. <laughs> they don't give him credit. They don't give him. They should the be really father of AIDS. Yeah, he, no, I'm I'm kind of. He was kind of robbed, you know. Like he he wrote in uh, the Declaration of Independence, you know, like an AIDS. Too. The Declaration of AIDS. Yeah, the Declaration what the of AIDS. What are you dependent. supposed to do here? Guys, I just thought of a new invention. It's called AIDS, <laughs> and there's more. <laughs> but wait. But wait. It gets better. <laughs> it's not just a good name. I feel like this is the most visually appealing I'm not, area. I'm gonna be the AVG and say, that's a dick. I think that's actually supposed to be a penis. Oh, like right there. Yeah, that it's literally a dick. It's like a big long thing with two little things on the side. Hmm, rub his chin? Could it be? Can the creator of this game please tell us if that was uh, subliminal messaging to make 
to hypnotize the audience to thinking about Chris, well, you know, which well, is, which is Chris's on. cock. Well done. I mean, I'm not, I'm not even being funny about that. You deserve the applause for that. Well, why were you we, holding your hand behind your back? Well, I was like really ear to ear, like the. Why were you crossing again? your fingers when you were clapping? Uh, you've caught me again. <laughs> 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 Foiled again, ah, damn you. Remember that time we got Lyle's groove back? We got my Lyle's mojo back? <laughs> my, my mojo. Lyle lost his groove, we had to get it back for him. He lost his mojo. Chris, I think you have to hit those guys when they come out. Oh, never mind. No, they're too mighty. What the hell? Who put these dang old things here? Just walk around him, dude. Lyle's new groove. <laughs> Lyle got his groove back. <laughs> I went to the pool, and there was this old man with a big pot belly came walking. He looked like a demon. He just, he, he's just this old. I don't know. All, the only story is that an old man picked his nose at the pool, but he says this guy was a, a, a demon. <laughs> <laughs> he does say the funniest shit. <laughs> Do, doesn't he say something like, Trump is running into a goblin den? <laughs> a goblin's nest, yeah. <laughs> a goblin's nest. <laughs> or is he just going, you know, around the goblins? He's got a goblin guide. Is it kissing goblins? Even though you still stab them, you give them a kiss? Is Trump going to have babies with a goblin? Is he going to marry a goblin? I don't want to be kissing goblins. Or I don't want to be kissing goblins or bedding goblins. Or oh, succubusing fuck. goblins, <laughs> he says that at one point. What are these fucking balls? Now, the people at home don't know how stressed out I am, but basically, Lyle has a knife in his hand that he's playing with, a big a big <laughs> knife, and Chris is, like, pulling his gun out of his waistband right there. So. Zach's right in the middle of it. I'm right in the middle. I'm looking left dab. and right, yeah. I'm looking left and right, smack dab in the middle of this whole situ situation. He's got his, his fingers in his teeth, and he's ch chattering them. Yeah. What do you think of my new gun? Uh, it's a nice, it's a nice weapon. I like, I like your initials on the side yeah, of it. Yeah, I, I kind of thought that maybe you weren't a man until you pulled it out, mm. and now I think that you are. Did you ever let someone uh, put an avocado on your boy pussy? No, <laughs> I don't think I need to. There's it's not about needs. It's there's about, already it's one It's about there. what's good for the the society of people. It's for the greater good, Chris. The greater good, yeah. He's fucking laughing at you. He face palms because you're so stupid. You are so stupid and funny. <laughs> hey, good old man, man. Hey. Uh, Chris, let's write a new episode of The Simpsons <laughs> where Lyle defeats this guy, right? <laughs> a new episode of The Simpsons? Yep. Why Kate. did you do like a Mexican Bart? Uh, that's the, that's man, the episode. Dude. That's the episode. Yeah. Oh, yeah you... The episode is the Bumblebee Man become Bart dies and <laughs> the Bumblebee Man becomes the Bart. New Bart because they're mourning. They're in such grief. <laughs> he shows up the Bart's funeral. You know, one time we had a you nice know what, chat. Yeah. Uh -huh. You know, one time I talked to Bart and uh, I think I got the gist of him. I think I can be him. <laughs> he only says one thing in Spanish, so I think I can handle. He it. says one thing in Spanish, so I'm basically the Bart. Okay. Merge. Bart is back for life. This is Bart. just as good, if not better. Bart has been resurrected as a meek. And Bart is talking a lot of sense. <laughs> <laughs> talking a lot of sense. And then, and then, and He's that... convinced me on many a thing. <laughs> <laughs> that is my child. I you know are it. my boy. <laughs> and then, and then, and then we cut to, and then we cut to the road of the Simpsons car, the iconic Simpsons car driving. Wait, 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 what are the seven stages of grief? There's like one of them is delusion. <laughs> one of them is, uh, <laughs> Delu delusion, fear, hatred, bigotry. <laughs> fucking, he, he fucking, like, targets the Simpsons while they're all deluded. Yeah, and yeah. And he prays on them. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, there's still a denial, basically. I think the first step is denial. <laughs> That's it, not delusion. Yeah, they're, Del they're all in denial, and, uh, and, You're deluded! And then we cut. We cut then to the Simpsons car driving, and, uh, of course, Homer and Marge are the front. In the back seat, we see Bumblebee Man ripping out Lisa's hair, and, and Homer goes, "Stop!" And Homer goes, "Stop!" Bart, yeah, get in her. Bart, leave your sister alone. Like and he's being way too rough on her. He's actually kind of hurting her. She's got bruises and welts all over her arms and shit. He's <laughs> pinching her really hard on you. He's got like a smile on his face, so he kind of enjoys it. It's like, the, it's like the good son <laughs> where Marge yells at Lisa for it. Lisa, stop, stop antagonizing yeah, your Lisa, brother. Lisa, leave your brother alone. Your Help brother Bob, just came please. back. Lisa, we thought he was dead. We thought he was dead. This is now you be nice to him. You be nice to your new Bart brother. I got him. And he, he squeezes her on he's the head. He's laughing. I am never going to get in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny now. It's because he's sadistic, he's evil. <laughs> then Mr. Burns notices Bart's new talents. <laughs> the episode's called Bart's New Talent. <laughs> <laughs> 
Since then, bring your boy into the nuclear power plant. Your boy is something special. He's Thank very you. cool and funny. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Burns. Ah, uh, Mr. Burns, uh, he is very cute and funny. No, Mr. Burns, he's mine. He's mine. <laughs> you can't have him smooth. <laughs> he becomes this beloved character. Everyone, everyone's fighting over him. <laughs> <laughs> Have I ever told you, you know, that kind of did happen to me in real life, where... <laughs> Wait, what? In what regard? No, what, what aspect of that story? Uh, the fact where some guy, he, he like, came into Wexford, this, like, Italian guy, and, like, he, he like, took over, like, like, he was just some random guy, that and, is so stupid. and everyone started, like, loving him, being, like, like... He became a celebrity? Give me a cool Italian name, we'll call him that, because I don't want to give him the real name. Go for Giuseppe. Okay, so Giuseppe moves into Wexford, he's an unknown guy, right? Well, this was in at least my parents' circle of friends, but this guy came in, uh, and everyone's like, who is this guy? And he's like, I'm buying this restaurant. He bought a restaurant, <laughs> and then everyone's like, wow, he bought the restaurant. He's amazing. And then he, he just started, like, going to everything, like, be being the host of everything, every party. He was just there, right? And everyone's like, wow, he's such an interesting character. Where did he come from? He marries some, wom like, woman. Uh, he jumped into, like... Do you remember when you visited Wexford, there was, like, this, like, shit river in the middle of town? Yes, I did with that. He literally was like, If this football team wins, I'm going to jump in that river! And then oh. they, they won, he jumped in, he cut his leg open on a shopping trolley, he got a tetanus shot. <laughs> oh my, wait, he almost, like, had, like, a septic infection where he had, like, a wound with, like, shit inside of it? Yeah. And then, uh, one day, my uncle told me this story where, uh, he was hanging out <laughs> with my dad, my uncle, and then he was just like, Hey, Nemo. take a drink of this coffee, right? And Nemo. He's like, no, no, I don't want to do that. He's like, go on, take a drink. And my uncle took the lid off the coffee and he put his finger in it and it, it like scalded him. Like, and he's just like, ah, I, you, you got me. Like, he pretty much was like, I'll get you another time. Oh my, he tried to burn yeah, this guy. Yeah, he's like, like this crazy fucking guy. And then eventually one guy was like, uh, you know, this guy's kind of like, he owes me a lot of money. And then he started going around asking everyone else being like, Hey, like, you guys know Giuseppe, like, <laughs> does he owe you money? And everyone's like, he owes me thousands of dollars. Who the fuck <laughs> is this guy? I this know, he was crazy. This and guy then, just came over and took over a whole town. Yeah, and then w w once, like, the, the word got out that he owed everyone thousands of dollars, he literally just fucking bailed and no one ever heard from again. And he married a girl, uh, like, he married a woman. And, and he, he just left her. And he left a wife? <laughs> yeah, it was fucking I wild. That. I love He probably, he, dude, this guy's probably been all over the world doing that. Probably! Moves to every, moves, moves to the country, jumps into the shit He was, like, getting like interviews on the radio and shit. Everyone's like, "So who are you?" you? <laughs> it was fucking. It was the weirdest shit ever. Like, <laughs> that is like an episode of a TV show. It really is. A new guy moves into town and everyone loves him. <laughs> and then he gets a septic. It was in literally like Armin Tamzarian <laughs> shit. It was like crazy. But yeah, wherever he is, I hope he's dead. Wherever you are, please let everyone know you're safe. We need to know you're okay. <sighs> Oh, what's that glowing sphere? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> the, the ancient Giuseppe powers! Wait, what? I will fool all of Wexford with this. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when he gets insulted by balloons. <laughs> yeah. How dare you use such offensive language? How dare you use such offensive language? How dare you? How dare you? I should be in Balloon World! <laughs> <laughs> this game has made more of an impact on me than any other we've played so far this year. It, 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 I remember if you asked me to tell you all the levels, I can remember all of them to a T perfectly. Like, Law, you were playing some bullshit. What was it called? I don't even remember. Some but the match is a Chris, on the other hand. I could recite from start to finish. Now that's a game I can take my head off to! <laughs> take your head <laughs> off? <laughs> I love I love a YouTube reviewer that's basically like is like a like a gentleman. He says, but he says like nice things. I could take my hat off to that. You know, great minds think alike. You know that, right? Our brains are connected by a tube. See, that's, that's the worst we got is uh, Jemima's witnesses. <laughs> <laughs> we, we watched an episode of Family Guy last night. Me and Zach and Tomar, where it was Stewie and Brian locked in a. It's the famous episode, yeah, they was like their big th They're locked in a vault, and, and Brian eats Stewie's asshole and shit, and I, I can't even believe it's real. <laughs> yeah, yeah it, it was like, I did that because I love you, or something you like know, that. It, Yeah, yeah like, they, they try to be really serious. I truly it. believe whoever wrote that was fetishizing it. Like, what, like why would you write that? They, I don't I was, think it was- I think that was like all improv -ed. Well, it's not fucking good. <laughs> I mean, it had it had to have been Whoever scripted. Wrote that it had to have been scripted, but it might have been written like straight ahead, basically, where they didn't structure it. But that's it, fine. But it, it no, was a dog eating a baby's asshole. It's not a good episode of Family Guy. There's like parts. There's a there's like a few parts that 
are not done as badly as others, but there are some points in that that are so fucking embarrassing. They, it's because they're trying to be really serious and like deep. They're actually trying to be like the fly episode of Breaking Bad. Yes, uh, they all, but they did another episode like that, like recently, where it's Whoa. like Stewie goes to a therapist, and the therapist is, um, I think it's, I think it's Patrick Stewart. Patrick Stewart. <laughs> I think so. But it's it's the same it's the same thing. It's like no cutaways. It's just Stewie talking to a therapist for like. Uh, 45 minutes, and he literally goes, This is my real voice! No. Yeah. Wait, no. like yeah. Peter's voice? Basi basically, he's like, Hi, this is what I really sound like. This, the British thing, is it real? Shut up! I'm not, I'm not, I'm not kidding, I'm not kidding. <laughs> For once, to talk with my real voice. <laughs> Why? <laughs> We should, That's we should, Erman Tamzarian no, shit! We, we, Why? We, we, should, we, should, we should watch it after this. I actually want to- I'm down to watch <sighs> it. Why is Brian talking about killing himself? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. That was so freaking deep! That should have won an Emmy. Oh, Brian, what? You had a gun! What because you a gun, Brian? I might kill myself, I don't know. It's like, shoot myself the fucking head, little baby Because Stewie. life is mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's deep! <laughs> I think he literally does say something like that, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, Brian! <laughs> <laughs> You know, Brian, I love you. Yeah, I love you doesn't too, he like stare at the floor and he's like, hey, I I care about you quite a lot. There's some yeah. bullshit you, like you, that. You could even say, I, I, I love you, Brian. <laughs> you could even say, I eat shit. And I, and I, and I eat shit. And you eat my shit and I eat shit. And I, I think one of the funnest things you could do as a grown male is act like a 12 year old, like, <laughs> and just go on YouTube and just fucking insult everybody. Just say, f you. This video sucks. You just, like, just search for new videos by little kids and just insult them. <laughs> I'm I'm as old as you, and I have to say this is stupid. <laughs> I'm your exact I'm your, I'm your exact age. I'm your, I'm your exact age, and I gotta say, man. Imagine doing. That. Imagine if you were forty, that's, and you're just that's like. That's gotta be the most psychotic thing to do. <laughs> like, what a waste of time. Can you imagine like doing that, like being forty and just like purposefully just being like, huh, I'm gonna use my superior adult's intellect. As a fourteen-year-old, as yeah. a fellow fourteen-year-old, I have to say this is stupid. I'm smarter than you, and I'm, and I'm younger than you. <laughs> I'm actually two years your junior, and I know twice as much. <laughs> oh. oh, you're so close! Yeah. Lyle! Lyle, think of the ballerina, babe. Lyle, sing Tiny Dancer! Woo! Didn't work, didn't matter. Which ball? Oh, he's you this guy. son of a bitch. We never beat the Peng Wars. Use your, uh, stinky meter. Use Nothing your about ice. me stinks, Chris. Your personality, your your looks, your clothes, your shoes, your, your socks, attitude. Yeah, your but aside armpits, from those. your belly button specifically. Yeah, that little crease between your ass and your thigh. Okay, well everybody has like seven or eight things on them that stink. All right, I'm just saying it's it's part of being human. Well, you ever dig your finger up your belly button and smell your finger? What are you talking about? When you dig your finger in your belly button and smell it, you ever stick your entire middle finger all the way in your belly button? <laughs> <laughs> Finger, <laughs> middle finger your belly button. And you twist it around and you, you, you go, oh it's kind of it's kind of a nice feeling. Uh what uh, happened? This is me waking up a couple oh what happened? Did you did you beat it? Zach, he killed him, Zach. Oh he, he beat really, the final boss. Oh that's wonderful. <laughs> oh yes, children living in my house. My favorite thing. <laughs> Insult Americans, uh. What are you, the UN? Get the fuck out of here, you stupid yeah, yellow get out bitch. Of here. We don't need to hear from you. You can't stop us from doing. I would love to see Aladdin fly through that little hole right there and, and, and come into the adventure. I <laughs> can show you my hole. <laughs> and he says, Look Aladdin. at it is right here. I bleached it and shaved it and poured <laughs> oil on it. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what caused all the redness <laughs> right around here. <laughs> <laughs> He's pointing to it. <laughs> Ignore this little thing. It is simply benign. Do you guys want to play geography trivia? Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes. You have ten seconds to answer okay. five questions. Uh, I know geography. Uh, what is the primary currency in uh, uh, dinner? Uh, 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 yen. Uh, 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 yeah, is it you want? Uh, uh, fuck. What, what is, is the capital, capital of Norway? Oh, oh, Oslo. Oslo. Yeah, yeah. Oslo. Argentina! Oh, Buenos Aires! Yeah! What is capital of India? Oh, Bombay! New Delhi! Is it? New Delhi or Bombay? It's one of those two. I think it's. The, yes! Yeah. Uh, uh, a pound! A pound! A pound! A pound! pound, pound, pound. Wow. Yeah! Wow. We yeah. fucking know more than the Mozart balloon! Look, it's yes. how pissed off it is. I love Mops. Mops. Here, I shall gift you with a Wait, No, no, no! <laughs> no, no, no! Wow, that's awesome. Wow, that's incredible. Wait, what the fuck is he giving you? I got a magic compass. That rocks. I want to see Lyle drawn in the Egyptian style. 
circumcising people. Guys, can you please Photoshop Lyle circumcising people on an Egyptian... <laughs> like a hieroglyphic? Like a hieroglyph of, of, of Lyle in the year 3000 BC circumcising himself. Yeah, also, make sure that my facial expression, I, I clearly don't know what I'm doing, like, have, like, a handkerchief and I'm, like, rubbing sweat off my forehead. Yeah, he's going, like, oh, fuck. Look at that red moon back there. Gee whiz. It just peeves me. Doesn't it make you just sad that the moon will never be that red again? <laughs> Sigh. So the moon, moon will never be blood red again. Whoa. Something feels off. Something feels a little <laughs> weird. <laughs> oh. Oh. Something feels oh, delicious No 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 money. no no no. Get it get out of here as fast as possible. I don't want to. Wait a second. That. Corpses. Someone breathing heavily. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. It's Tay Zunday breathing into the mic. <laughs> Steps away from mic to breathe. <laughs> Chocolate rain! Some stage right on our field rain. Chocolate rain. Tays on day. <laughs> Thumbs your eyes and gets into your brain. <laughs> <laughs> Tays on day. Where did you go? When are you coming back? I think we've talked about it before, but my favorite thing is he did Chocolate Rain, which was his, like, his heartfelt, his truly heartfelt. You know, song about black about, oppression about or something. Black oppression, chocolate rain. Some say dry waters feel the pain, right? Mm. And then he did a sequel called Cherry Chocolate Rain, which is a coke <laughs> ad. You going, Cherry Chocolate Rain. There's yeah. a girl's dancing. Like he's got, a, girls he's got like, a briefcase full of money. It's the funniest. Cherry Chocolate Rain. It's the funniest fucking two videos <laughs> in a row. Just the the juxtaposition. I can feel my tummy, tummy rumbling. Oh my god, man. are you having a heart attack? Do you feel a pain shooting down your right nut? After this, do you want to get food, by the way? No, I don't eat anymore. Oh, really? Yeah, it's a waste of time. You can just inject nutrients from tablets directly into your eyes and you'll get everything you need. If you cut your eye in half and put a, a fish oil pill inside and close it back <laughs> up, it'll absorb about five times faster, I think. All the five hour energy is, it's like 20,000% your daily B12. Yeah, that's... You know, you've that's... said that before and I, I looked at it, it's not the case. They do sell ones that are just B12 shots, though. They're, the, they're the different ones, things. The, one, the ones, the normal ones, in fact, I think I bought one in the fridge, it's like literally 18,000% your daily dose of yeah, B12. Yeah, it's something ridiculous. But that, that's pretty much all it operates on. I'm sure it's got caffeine and stuff, but that's mostly what it is. It's got to fuck with you chemically somehow. Oh, yeah. Like, they do hard. Like, my doctor was like, fucking don't d drink those. You should those. not be drinking those. You should... Like, it's really not good to drink. I think it's because... It, I mean, you can take it once and it'd be fine. It's it's if you... Yeah, no. It's I, I was drinking like five or six a day. For how long? I don't know. Well, like three years. <laughs> three years? <laughs> we that's ready? why you look like that. That's why, that's what happened. Lyle, well, you look so fucking like- That's why he's got the two eye patches in the wheelchair. He's got green bags under his eyes. <laughs> he's got... faster than anyone who's ever been. That's that's why Lyle's first words to me were ignore the green. <laughs> Didn't make any sense until now. Uh. Ignore the green parts of my body, they're just rotting. <laughs> the green parts of my body. I'm, I'm dealing with it, please, you have to understand. My name is Chris! <laughs> I wanted to ask if uh, you could, you know, give me a handy J. Susan. Majiski? Susan? Wait, that's... Uh oh I'm demonetizing everything! Ah! That looks awesome! The word demonetize has the word demon in it, so... Yeah, and monetize. Demon, yeah. monetize. Is that a big crab claw? What is that? That's its, it's scorpion tail, he I think? He did a crab claw? He did a crab claw? What the hell? Yeah, crab oh, it claw? Is a, it is a scorpion. Lewis? Oh. Lewis? It's an onk bitch! Oh, is, is it when she's charging up you can hit her? I think, I think you can also reflect that. Dude, onk bitches, they suck your dick and then ghost you. What's wrong with that? Nuh -uh. Nothing. It's just a fucking fact of life. <laughs> uh, maybe I'm supposed to deflect You're, that? Yeah, 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 deflect it with a sword. <laughs> no? Or it at least, it at least, like, stops it. Maybe I it. have to, like, hit it back? No? Now okay. you gotta fight that big old squirrel. Yeah, do I have to again? do the whole thing again? I bet you do. On that note. Why do I really... Yerp. Do. To yerps.